This pastry looks so yum. Look who came for a chair in this. It's an ant. <laughs> Ants can lift about 100 times of their own body weight. You want to know more about this? Let's learn about bugs today. A person who studies or is an expert about bugs is called an entomologist. There are about 1 million various known species of bugs in the world. The scientific name for bugs is arthropods. Arthropods include insects, arachnids, and crustaceans. Crustaceans usually do not count as bugs. Let's learn about them one by one. Insects have three body parts, the head, thorax, and abdomen. They have six jointed legs and two antenna. Some insects have a pair of wings. Most insects produce eggs. Now look at this ant. Its body has three parts, head, thorax, and abdomen. It has six legs and two antenna. It is an insect. Some other insects we see around us are bees, these lovely butterflies, this beetle, and look at this grasshopper. It has three body parts, a pair of antenna and six legs. This is also an insect. Some insects carry diseases and harm crops. However, some insects can be useful as they can produce honey, wax, silk, etc. Isn't it so much fun learning this? Oh, you are preparing the chart. Great! Now, let's understand a little bit about arachnids. There are about 100,000 various known species of arachnids in the world. The word arachnid comes from a Greek word that means spider. Arachnids are commonly called spiders. They lay eggs to reproduce. Now, look at this spider. It is an arachnid. It has two main body divisions, the cephalothorax and the abdomen. You can see they have eight legs. Some other arachnids are scorpions, ticks, mites, and harvestmen. Now we will learn about crustaceans that are not usually referred to as bugs, but they actually come under the anthropods, or bugs. Crustaceans reproduce through externally fertilized eggs. Females produce eggs in their ovaries, and males fertilize the eggs after they leave the female's body. Look at this crab. This is a crustacean. It has a hard covering called an exoskeleton and two pairs of antenna. The front end, or head, is called an acron. The tail differs from species to species. Some other examples are water flea, shrimps, prawns, and woodlice. Now you know a lot about bugs. Can you show the drawing to your friends? Here are some important fun points about bugs. Beetles account for about one quarter of all the known species of animals and plants. Snails can sleep for about three years without eating anything. Ladybirds are a gardener's best friend as they can eat as many as 5,000 aphids in its lifetime. A female black widow's poison is about 15 times deadlier than a rattlesnake's poison. A mosquito can flap its wings 500 times in a second. Isn't it so interesting? Now we will see the differences between insects, arachnids, and crustaceans. Look at this. Insects have six legs, arachnids have eight, and crustaceans have ten legs. An insect's body has three segments, an arachnid's body has two segments, and a crustacean's body also has two segments. Insects have two antenna, arachnids have no antenna, and crustaceans have four antenna. Examples of insects are the ant and bee. Examples of arachnids are the spider and scorpion. And the example of crustaceans is a crab and shrimp. I hope you liked the video. Stay tuned for more fun videos and always help others. Bye-bye!